Hi, I'm Phil Spencer. Welcome to another of my Move IQ property tours. Today I'm delighted to introduce you to Filmworks. Filmworks is a development by St George in Ealing, West London. The development has an eight screen picture house cinema and central piazza surrounded by restaurants, coffee shops and leisure facilities. It's all going on here. Enjoy the tour. Filmworks is an exciting development built on the site of a beautiful 1920s Art Deco cinema. Ealing Studios is just a stone's throw away and Filmworks retains its cinematic roots in many ways, not least of all by the fact that they've retained the original iconic 1920s cinema facade. With great transport links, the Tube is just a short five minute walk away where the newly opened Elizabeth Line takes you into the centre of London in just 11 minutes. This development has it all. A great location, a boulevard of shops and restaurants which creates a real sense of community on the outskirts of London and the nearby Walpole Park which gives you that green space right on your doorstep. But if that wasn't enough for you, there's also an eight screen cinema complex opening later in 2022, once again bringing the focus back to the area. All the buildings in this development are named after movie stars from the past. The apartments I'm going to look at are inside Hawkins House, which is named after the movie icon Jack Hawkins. Inside the corridors, there are some really nice nods back to the building's Art Deco history, including the styling of the lights, the font used on the letters and the numbering, even the lift has its own nice Art Deco touch. Now, the apartments I'm going to show you are all available on the Discount Market Scheme, otherwise known as the DMS. So let's take a look. And when you come into the apartment, you're greeted by this really nice welcoming entrance area. Great place to put some furniture and has views all the way through the space. The bathroom is right up here. Sometimes bathrooms in apartments can feel a bit hemmed in, but it's not the case here. This one's been really well thought out and even comes with a highly desirable walk-in shower. And then we move on to the bedroom. Now what's really nice about this apartment is, although it's a Manhattan style and therefore is all about this open plan living, the bedroom somehow feels like a completely different space removed from the rest of the living area. It's also really warm and cozy and pretty stylish. It's big enough to fit a decent sized double bed. You get your bedside tables and the desk in here as well. And just on the other side of the walkway, there's a really big area that's perfect for a standalone wardrobe or if you wanted, a built-in wardrobe, entirely up to you. Now, this apartment measures 424 square feet, and yet it feels much, much bigger than that. That's partly down to the layout, and also you have this really nice sized living room. It's got these big windows which allow light to flood in from Bond Street, but as you can see, you can get some really good sized furniture in here. There's a three seat sofa, there's a nice armchair in the corner, even a dining area space too. But there's also loads more room on top of that. Finally, we move on to the kitchen. Now I say finally because there's also a really big double door cupboard just off to the side, which is perfect for your washing machine. Also a great extra storage space too. The kitchen, as you can see, is a good size. It comes with an oven and a hob and plenty of cupboard space too. It really does round off what is a very nice Manhattan style apartment. Now these apartments come in a variety of different sizes and layouts and some of them feature one of these, the partition wall. This is great for dividing the living room from 
the bedroom, and it really does emphasize the different use of the space. So there you have it. If you'd like to find out any more information about these Manhattan style apartments available on the discount market scheme or check out any other options on this St. George's Filmworks development, then head to the Barclay Group website or click on the link below.